Known as the most visited city in the world and a culturally diverse city with more than 300 spoken languages, London is a hub for gay travellers. With its gay district Soho being one of the largest and most vibrant in Europe. If you come to London, this is the video you need to watch before getting here for the gay nightlife, Mighty Hoopla, London Fetish Week and the best gay sauna and cruising areas. Don't miss any travel tips and make sure to subscribe and ring the notification bell. What is the best time to visit London? From the weather perspective, the best time to visit London is from May till August. These months are the sunniest. Visiting during the spring or autumn are the best times if you want to avoid the crowds, but keep in mind that the weather can be changeable and there will be sunny and rainy days. Do you want to celebrate Pride in London? Make sure you visit during the end of June or 1st of July. Check the Pride London website for the specific date. Now let's dive into the best gay parties in London. Mighty Hoopla is the ultimate London largest LGBTQ plus pop festival at Brockwell Park. Each year, the show brings together some of the best drag acts from the best drag shows, brings together famous pop bands and brings together some of the hottest emerging acts in the British scene. Pride London stands out as one of Europe's most iconic parades, drawing participation from over 30,000 individuals and attracting up to 1 million spectators. The event's centerpiece, the main stage, is located at the historic Trafalgar Square. The Pride weekend is marked by numerous large circuit events celebrating Pride. Leather and Fetish Week in London offers some great events at various locations around the city with themes including uniform, leather, fetish, skinheads, sports equipment and rubber. London has a diverse leather and fetish scene with leather bars, pop-up parties and fetish nights taking place throughout the year. Some of the most popular include Hard on London, The Bunker and Vault 139. Now let's look at the typical prices in London. The United Kingdom was a member of the European Union till the 31st of January 2020. The British pound is the currency of the United Kingdom. First, let's look at a nice place to stay. The best neighbourhoods to stay in are Soho and Vauxhall. Soho Gay Area is located in the centre of the city, close to the Piccadilly Circus. The gay area of Vauxhall is located south of the Thames River near Vauxhall Bridge. Don't forget, London is not a cheap city to stay in, especially in the centre, so be prepared to spend some money here. Staying here in a budget hotel that starts from €85 Euro per night. Mid-range hotels begin at €150 Euro per night and go up to €350 Euro a night. And if you're looking for luxury five-star hotels, it starts at €217 Euro per night. Are you booking a city trip to London? I have listed gay-friendly hotels especially for you. Check the link at the top right. Are you ready for some delicious food? You can try some typical English cuisine. Fish and chips, a beloved comfort food consisting of battered and fried fish accompanied by crispy potatoes. If you're a breakfast fan, you can try a full English breakfast that offers a generous platter featuring eggs, bacon, sausages, beans, tomatoes and mushrooms providing a true taste of British morning tradition. There are also different choices for dining in a restaurant. Dining in an inexpensive restaurant will cost you around £18 per person. If you enjoy food and want to go for a mid-range restaurant with a three-course meal, the costs will be around £50 per person. If you love fine dining, you can have a four-course menu in a Michelin star restaurant, £60 per person. Do you want an experience of the best of Michelin star dining in London? Visit a Gordon Ramsay restaurant and enjoy for £260 per person a carte blanche menu. These prices are on average and can change depending on the restaurant, cafe and location. The best gay clubs and bars in London. London has a very open, vibrant and diverse gay scene with something for everyone. There are a lot of lively gay bars, nightclubs, cruising clubs and more. London has two main gay villages located in Soho and Vauxhall. 
However, there are many more fabulous gay venues across the city, not only in these two areas. The Glory is one of East London's best gay bars, drag hothouses, LGBTQ plus performance venues, nightclubs and curators of London shows, festivals, contests and battles. Royal Vauxhall Tavern opened its Victorian doors including fetish events, drag shows, lesbian night butch pleas, club nights and monthly pop fest push the button. Heaven is known as London's first gay super club. On Thursdays, it hosts different parties, for example. Fridays are filled with 80s and 90s, and Saturdays are reserved for the main GAY club night, often featuring appearances from RuPaul's Drag Race stars. Tourists and the younger crowd love it here. Dalston Superstore is the place to have brunch and burgers, and by night, it's London's best pansexual party spot. The upstairs bar is fun for a warm-up drink, and the club is in the basement. Eagle London is the birthplace of horsemeat disco. It is styled after New York's meatpacking district and guarantees wild nights out with various DJs on call to keep the dance floor heaving. Eagle attracts an older crowd, but the overall ambience now feels slick and sexy rather than, well, slightly sleazy. There are many more gay clubs and bars in London. You can check them all. What are the best gay saunas and cruising bars in London? There are plenty of gay saunas to enjoy in London. Most of the venues are well-maintained facilities and memberships are not required. One of the city's most popular venues is Sweatbox Sauna and an award-winning gay sauna in Soho. This is a 24-hour gay sauna that includes a fully equipped gym, jacuzzi, private cabins, big steam room, infrared sauna and hosts London's only gay steam maze and foam parties. Pleasure Drome is a smaller sauna and attracts all body types and ages. Behind the discreet entrance, you will find deluxe pods and rooms to rent, spa pool, two steam rooms, two saunas, lounge area, cinema, darkroom and sunbeds. Pleasure Drome also has a 24-hour bar. Into a cruising adventure? London is the epicentre of gay cruising on the streets, in the bars, in the parks and in the clubs. Visit Central Station, legendary King's Cross Pub and Club with regular gay cruising nights. Now let's have a look at London's sightseeing highlights for gay travellers. London a city braced by its regal history and a pulsating culture. There are so many things to do in London, I highlighted some of them. Watch a fabulous musical at the West End. Here you will find the best musicals at any time of the year, such as Mamma Mia, The Lion King and Kinky Boots. Visit the Shard, the tallest building in the UK. You can go to the top cool view from the Shard, where you can enjoy the London skyline. It's a very romantic experience, especially after sunset when the city is completely lit up. Standing tall at the north end of the Palace of Westminster, Big Ben is more than just a clock tower. It's a symbol of resilience and continuity. Officially known as the Elizabeth Tower, it houses the great bell known as Big Ben. For fans of the Wizarding World, the Harry Potter Studio Tour London is a must visit. Located just outside London, Warner Bros. Studio Tour London offers a behind the scenes glimpse into the making of the Harry Potter movies. From walking through the Great Hall of Hogwarts to exploring Diagon Alley, visitors can immerse themselves in the enchanting world that has captured the hearts of millions. The Tower of London's formidable structure by the River Thames is a narrative of power, intrigue and survival. Do you love history? Visit the Natural History Museum. With a vast collection that spans billions of years, it showcases everything from dinosaur skeletons to meteorite. The Tate Modern is a leading modern art gallery. Its collection includes works from Picasso, Warhol and Dali, among others. London is historical, magical and modern, making it a unique destination. 
a must visit if you like to party, visit museums, or the magic of the wizarding world. London has something for everyone. Thank you for watching this video, and if you're looking for more gay travel tips, make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. Share with us what you're looking forward to the most on your London adventure in the comments below. Safe travels and embrace the magic of London. See you next time.